Hi everybody, I'm Kat from Cats Gun Global. Today we are checking out Brixton. It used to be an area I lived by and I've spent quite a lot of time here. It's one of my favorite areas because it's really diverse. There's lots of things going on and as you can hear all the noise in the background, there is never a quiet moment here. So I'm gonna show you some of my favorite things to do in Brixton. Today we are at Canova Hall having brunch. As you can see, the brunch looks absolutely amazing. Uh, Brixton has quite a good range of um, restaurants and places to go and eat. Behind me is Hot Brixton. It was originally set up as a pop-up event and is now become a permanent part of Brixton. You can go in there, there's like a Kiwi wine shop, so you can have some New Zealand wine, there's a great pass place, and if you have a South London card, you can get 10% uh, off in some of these places. So make sure you look into grabbing one of those. Brixton has a great live music scene. I recommend checking out gigs at the Brixton Academy. If not, you can catch some live music at Fusion Annie's and a few other venues around Brixton. Around Brixton, you will find quite a lot of murals and one of the most famous ones, of course, is David Bowie because he's from Brixton. Uh, so the community was really sad when he died. And as you can see, lots of people pay tribute by leaving flowers and paying their respects. So we've already visited the David Bowie mural, but as you can see, there's so many murals around Brixton. These are meant to depict the community, politics and ideas and painted by locals and they were funded by the Lambeth Council after the riots in 1981. Uh, so it's something that you can see quite frequently around Brixton. One of the most famous things to do in Brixton is to go to Brixton Village and Market Road. They have lots of shops, lots of places to eat, um, and it's just a great atmosphere to walk around. So make sure you check this out. So to end our tour of Brixton, right behind me is the Ritzy. It's a great two listed building and it was built in 1911 and it's been restored to have a cafe and you can catch some films here. So it's a really good place to hang out if you want some chill time and grab a drink. If you want to know more about London, don't forget to check out my London travel tips. I'll leave the links in the boxes somewhere around here.